Monday. Welcome to a very exciting Monday. The sun is shining. It is such a nice start to the week. This one is off work and we are heading to one of our favourite, favourite places. We've been up nice and early this morning and taking the dogs out for a nice little walk. It is absolutely boiling. It's so nice and sunny and we are packed up in the car ready to head over to one of our favourite, favourite spas um, which is in a place called Stone and it's Modishall Oaks. We've been there before. I thought we'd been twice but Rick seems to think we haven't. We've only been once. Oh god, there's a car the, crash up there, Rick. I don't know, it was the first place we went away together for a night away. So we're in the car, so as soon as we get there, we will show you around. We're gonna stop off for a bit of lunch before and then go for a really nice chill. We've picked the best day because the sun is shining. I'm ready to sit down in the sun and just relax for 24 hours. So we're gonna bring you along with us to enjoy our little spa trip together. I think this is literally the exact same room that we stayed in last time. It's so, so nice. Look, we've got a nice big four post bed, nice little seating area, and just outside, it's just literally like in the middle of nowhere, but we also have a hot tub. So we're gonna book that for this evening as well. It is so hot, but we decided we're gonna be good and go to the gym. Why are you hiding behind the bed? I'm you look like you're hiding. <laughs> So um, yeah, we've just chucked all our gym stuff. We thought we'll go and do a quick little workout because they've got an amazing fitness center here. So we're gonna go and do that first and then chill out for the evening. Want a drink later. <laughs> but yeah, it's really, really nice to be back. I'm very hot and sweaty. It's really, really warm here. And I'm feeling really achy. I am so ready for my massage tomorrow because I don't know what is wrong with my arms and my shoulders. I just feel so achy. So I'm really looking forward to that. I'm gonna have a nice um, massage and then facial, like all in one treatment. So that will be nice. Yeah, no one's bothered about your shoulders. Show them the bath. <laughs> nice little bathroom. I'm gonna have a great big bath in here very soon. Very nice. Why do you turn such a loser when the camera goes off? <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna go and do a little workout. I didn't really bring workout stuff, so I've just got this t-shirt on that I've had on today. And my gym leggings and my trainers, which are killing my feet. They're little um, Nike shocks and I've put them in the wash and they have shrunk so much. They feel so small on my feet. So right, should we go and hit the gym? Training, we? Oh well we have haven't we? We have some matching trainers going on. <laughs> right, come on, let's go and do this workout and then get in that hot tub and get in the sun. Yeah? Yeah. Ready? Shoulders today. What am I training? You gonna train me today? No. Yeah. You've not trained me in ages. I think you, you should. The gym I know. First time back all year. I'm gonna die. See you in 40 minutes when I will be a very big sweaty mess. So I'm feeling very, very relaxed right now. We have had a nice little glass out, uh, nice little glass, a nice little glass of wine out by the, um, there's like a bubble pool. It's so, so nice. We sat out there and had a little glass of wine and then we've sat in the jacuzzi for the past half an hour and had another glass of wine and oh, I'm feeling so relaxed right now. How peaceful is it? The bubbles have gone off. I know, I just noticed that. Do you want me to pop them back on for you? Uh, that one. There you go. We've had a couple of glasses of wine and just chilled. It's so lovely here. It's literally just in the middle of nowhere. The sun is setting, the birds are tweeting. We just sat here and just chatted for probably the longest we've chatted in all for the last kind of couple of months. Happy now? 
I'm really impressed with this glass because it floats. Don't drink the red wine in the jacuzzi, Richard. <laughs> Your phase of concentration then. <laughs> Need a boat. <laughs> so we're going to go and get ready and um, just have some nice dinner. I think so I'm going to go pour myself. Pour myself. I'm going to go and run myself a really nice big bath with loads of bubbles in and get myself ready. I have another glass of wine, I think. I'm so pale. <laughs> only because I'm fake tanned earlier, like oh, two layers. Brilliant. I'm getting more and more brown by the day. This is tan looks and it's actually such a nice tan. It's the first time I've used it and I'm really, really impressed with it. It's, look how nice that colour is. Pale and baldy. You look very pale next to me right now. Well, I'm receding massively. Kind of closer, Rick wants to shave his head off because he basically thinks he's losing his hair and he's got a receding hairline, which he has very slightly. Could be worse, you could be grey like me. No, I could take grey and have a full head of hair. <laughs> I just don't know. I think I need more tattoos because that's what looks really pale. Oh, I think you're fine. Huh? I think you're fine. No, you don't look pale. You've actually got a tan for you, that's quite brown for you. It's just because you're next to like the brightest book person in the world right now with this tan. But how nice is this tan? So I put it on really, really quickly um, when we were leaving and it's like an oil. I brought it with me. My hands are a little bit dodge, but not too bad. But, um, oh, I think I've got myself ready. I'm going to have a glass of wine, I don't care. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to go and run this bubble bath. I am going to have another glass of wine and get ready for a nice snazzy little meal. <laughs> I knew you were going to do that then. <laughs> we are about to go and get some dinner. I am actually so hungry now. It is about eight o'clock. So I'm actually, just realised I don't have my watch on. I'm going to put my watch on. And uh, we're going to go out for some dinner at the little restaurant here. The food is supposed to be amazing. So we have got ourselves all dressed up. I've washed my hair. I've just dried my hair with this, which is a GHD um, hair dryer. And this is the best hair dryer I've used in a long, long time. I think I'm gonna invest because it's made my hair so shiny and like smooth and just feels really, really nice. So I'm very happy with that. That was just in the room, so I've just used that. And I think I'm gonna have to go and get one of those. Um, but yeah, we just got ready, super, super quick. I will show you my outfit. So I've just popped on this really easy to wear, like, sorry Rick's let you go change to you. You have clothes on now. Made me dress like a grown up. Oh, you look nice, babe. You look very smart. You do look smart. Do you do. I've just put on this, which is, it's the little play suit dress from Lemon Milk. And it's like a little, it's kind of like a little smock dress. So I just thought this is going to be really comfy and cosy to wear and um, it has pockets, which, pockets. yeah, it has pockets. I love pockets in a dress. So I just thought this is really, really nice for tonight. I can go and eat as much as I want, drink as much as I want and just be comfy. And then I just put these little heels, which are the little kind of like Chanel vibes heels from Lindsay Shoes, which I've not actually had a chance to wear much of because I got them at like the beginning of lockdown and we don't go anywhere. So I just thought this is a really easy, cute and comfy outfit um, that I just grabbed because I didn't know I didn't know what I was going to wear, so I just thought this is a really easy outfit to wear. So I was actually going to wear this dress with some cowboy boots, but there wasn't enough room in my suitcase for both. So I just grabbed these because I thought these are going to be, these are just, just, these are just going to look nice no matter what, whereas the cowboy boots were a little bit of a risk. Classy and cute little outfit. So I love this. And I think this is one that I'm definitely going to wear into autumn because I am going to wear it with some boots. I thought it would look really cute, just this and like a, um, like a, my oversized leather jacket and some cute little boots would be really nice for like daytime. So yeah, getting my wear out of it, even though summer is going. But it's actually been the loveliest afternoon. I do feel very chilled now. I've had two glasses of wine and got myself ready in peace. My makeup is 
a lot of little newbies actually i've had a new delivery from benefits which i will be sharing with you probably on the next vlog after this because i want to do like a full face of like benefit makeup with you because some of the new bits that i've tried i absolutely love this is the lipstick from l'oreal which is the chocolate one i'll link it in the description below and again i just love this it's so nice for autumn such a nice little autumny look and yeah i've used lots of like i've used the benefit concealer foundation their bronzing palette and i'm actually in love it's a really nice little new lot of makeup that i've got for autumn so i'm excited to start trying out new little looks with those i popped on my favorite little primark earrings which i always get so many messages about these are literally just from primark and i love them they look so cute and chic and uh yeah just gonna go and drink loads of wine eat loads of food I've spoken to the kids, they're all absolutely fine at home with the dad. Um, although we have had a little discussion with Effie. We have just put screen time on her phone, so she, her phone cuts off at 8 o'clock. So she's trying to find every excuse under the sun to try and get this code for screen time so she can change things. Um, so she said she wanted a Halloween costume. Rick sent her a lovely Halloween costume of a big, huge pumpkin yeah. that he said she could wear instead. Um, so yeah, that was eventful. But yeah, we're just going to get some food now, I think, aren't we? Are you ready? I'm starving now. Are you all ready? Yeah, wow. Oh my God, that was so quick. Wow, I've gone up already. You can tell you, you can't piss back with perfection, can you? You look very smart. Not, not very often that you see you looking very smart. You look like a grown up. Oh, yeah. you look nice, babe. I know, you actually need to chuck them in the bin, they've got a no. hole in. No, Joe, you get short. Very nice. You look very handsome, Richard. We don't go anywhere, do we? No. It's it. It's what happens when you have kids and... I don't know, I've seen it. More of like, get out, have a piss about for a day out somewhere in the beach or the woods or something and then get a piece yeah. or a bag of chips. <laughs> cheap day. Right, well we're going to go have some wine and nice food now instead. Cheap day. Cheap day. <laughs> and hopefully not get too drunk because we've got to be up at like 6.30 to make this yoga class in the morning. We just realised we need masks. <laughs> and... Uh, Thank you. I've forgotten them. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just posting <laughs> my picture. It's 20 past eight, so it is time to post. We talk, took a quick picture today while we were, it's not gonna focus, out at lunch. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I got my little mask. I don't wanna put this mask on, it's gonna ruin my lip gloss. Oh, I also don't have my lip gloss. Let me just grab it. Sorry, sorry, sorry. You just need matte lip glosses at the moment. It's the only thing you can wear with these women masks. So we need to just wear masks in the, oh, light's gone out. So we've got to wear masks in the corridors and in the re restaurant before you sit down. So I'm gonna put my mask on. I should be back. Stick and makeup is gonna be ruined now. See, this is where you laughed at me earlier, but these people are great. Cape. I had a cape on now, just... <laughs> you also look like an absolute idiot. I feel like my lipstick is going to be half the way up my face by the time I get to the restaurant. <laughs> what does it do to your ears? You look like... Too small, aren't they? Hob. Just too small. <laughs> Try and 
much should I get into this? So yeah, pretty, feeling pretty relaxed this morning. Um, and it is about six o'clock. I think it's 7.15, doing a yoga meditation class around at like uh, Maid, which is like the health um, and like fitness center. So that'd be really nice. My head is really sore this morning. I've been bitten by something last night, you know, like a midget, it's so sore. Last time we did yoga, sweating that hard. It's hard. It's really hard, babe. Well, that like, old lady who was with, like was 65, 70, kind of farted. Yeah, right in front of you as well. She was it? breezing through it. <laughs> and I was like, I was shaking, sweating. <laughs> Guy kept coming over to me, going, No, 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 your arms should be. Oh, okay, you don't bend that far. <laughs> Just do what you can. In other words, just keep out of everyone's way and go and sit in the corner if you can't do anything. Try it. We're going to go and do some yoga. What some time is it, actually? No, I've got in about half an hour. Flexibility is not a strong point. How sleepy were you last night? You curled up in bed and you were late. Are you very cozy? Oh, we're wall bomb. We left the air con on, didn't we? It freezing. Yeah, it was boiling. I thought we were, I lost myself, I thought we were in Spain or something. What a beautiful morning. So the wellness centre is literally here, right next to the spa. So we've booked on in a, on, I can't speak, I'm so wide out this on. We've booked on the, I think it's called Glow, is it called Glow? Yeah. Um, and it's like yoga meditation, so we're gonna go and do that now. I'm hoping they're gonna do it outside, right? I'm not sure, we will see. The wellness centre that they have here too, which is so nice. We've been for a lovely, lovely breakfast, and so full right now. And uh, just ready to chill out, I think now. I'm gonna go and pack our room up, and then get ready for a day doing nothing. Having a massage, facial, It'll be nice. And the sun has come out from behind the clouds. It's going to be gorgeous. So we're off to a very, very relaxing morning, which basically consisted of sleeping, <laughs> reading. Rick fell asleep on a new audio book and lasted about a chapter. You were fast asleep, weren't you? Woke up at seven. <laughs> so I'm feeling very, very relaxed. It is so sunny. We just sat and chilled for like three hours in the sun, in this beautiful sun. And um, it's been lovely. I've been reading my book and drinking lots of water and feeling like I'm on holiday. I wrap myself up in my robe like a little bug and had a Stays for about an hour. We've been in the outside, what's it called? Like an outside, like bubble jet pool thing. It feels like, jacuzzi, yeah, like a big, huge outside jacuzzi, which is lovely. Which I would show you, but there's loads of people in there, so I don't think they're going to appreciate me um, coming there <laughs> along with my camera filming everyone. And um, it's been really, really relaxing. It's made me feel like I want a holiday. It's just been a real like holiday vibes and it's making me miss going on a holiday. Yeah, just relaxing and doing nothing. It's been lovely. So we're just about to have some lunch before I'm having a full like all-in-one treatment. I can't remember exactly what it's called, but it's an Elemis treatment and it's basically a full body massage and it also includes a facial as well. So we've got that in about an hour, so go have some food and uh, another hour of an hour of sunshine before we're going to have that and then it's going to be like a shock to the system going home to all the kids this afternoon after such a relaxing little day. 
going to be chaos when we get home. I don't actually know what to have. What are you going to have, babes? Vegan pesto mozzarella panini. Mm. We've just come out of our treatments. I've had like a two hour massage and facial. I think by far it was the nicest massage I've ever had. And my facial was so good. My skin feels so hydrated. We're just having a little wonder. It's gorgeous here. We've got a gorgeous lake. This is down by the restaurant. It's so peaceful. And look over here, there's two little hammocks. So I think we're just gonna sit in these hammocks for 10 minutes by the lake and just chill after our little our treatments. I had um, all Elmis products and oh, it feels my, feel, my face feels so good. She used the gel mask, she gets really deep into your skin and will help with like um, hormonal breakout that I always get around my chin. And then she put some lavender on, some lavender thing, it was so nice. The best massage I think I've ever, ever had. And uh, went on and on, it was like two hours. <laughs> I feel so relaxed now. Back, legs, and then facial. Back, shoulders, legs, facial. So, risk of hammocks is the sole risk of the user. Are you getting on? I don't know. <laughs> I didn't know why I brought my towel. <laughs> So you're going to sit on these little hammocks for a minute? It's getting on fine, thank you, getting up then. Come on then. Oh my god. <laughs> Do you have shorts on? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> All you can hear is the birds. Oh. I'm going to try and get on this hammock now. Oh my good god. On. <laughs> I'm on. You feel really relaxed now. And now we've got to go back for the kids. <laughs> I'm hungry again. Are you? Yeah. Oh, we need a hammock in our garden. These are so nice, aren't they? How do you rock it? My skin is looking very pale now, but it feels amazing. I'm hoping this little break up my chin is going to go. I've really enjoyed our little stay. I feel so chilled. It's been lovely been really really nice to come back here we've not been for a few years and it's made one it's made me want a holiday because we've had the nicest weather and two it's made me think that I'd quite like to come and do two nights would you do two nights Rick oh God, yeah. I think you'd really switch off after two nights I've got to start drinking. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it would be really nice, wouldn't it, now, just to have a bottle of wine and another meal and another early night. So I think next time we come, Champagne. we'll do two <laughs> nights and just completely switch off. Maybe for my birthday. I was thinking as well when I was getting my massage done, I'm just going to book myself in for a monthly massage as a little treat because my shoulders always get so, so tense and they've been so sore for weeks and weeks and I feel a million times better for that massage so yeah. Best bit about this one is when you find knots, when you find knots in your back, mm. they actually worked all then. Yeah. Whereas normally they just stick to the routine. Yeah. She actually focused on bits that were wrong. Yeah. No, my therapist was amazing. I swear she was shoving her elbow in the back. <laughs> Probably your back. So yeah, I think we are the colour of my face next to my hands. My face is so pale, I never tan it. So um, yeah, on that note, I'm gonna sign off this vlog here before we go home and pick up the munchkins and the poppers and probably be in bed for 10 o'clock again. Completely exhausted. But um, I'll put all the details of Modulates in the description. Um, and hopefully they will be able to give me a little bit of a discount code that you guys can use as well. Um, but yeah, we love it here. We've been a few times. I would 100% recommend it. We've had an amazing time and um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed watching this vlog. And I'll see you in my next video. Love you all.